Hey everyone, this is Kate Schwanky, and I have a unboxing for you guys today. This is my box from Laura's Little Boutique. Um, if you remember seeing my video that I did for Laura's Little Boutique a couple of weeks ago, it was when I was picking my print placement on JGB items, um, mostly Tokidoki. And so that's what this box is. It actually came in, um, today is Thursday, and it came last Friday, but I was gone on vacation, so... And I've been waiting to open it all this time for this video, um, which is difficult if you know that you've been waiting for a package and it's got stuff you really want in it. It's difficult. But I love doing videos for you guys where I unbox because I love to show how just excited I am and just, that's me. <laughs> when you see me open a box, it's like Christmas. So here we go. I've got my scissors. I can't wait to open this. You know, what's funny is that out of all the things that I ordered, I think for some reason the Jujube Be Neat in Animalini is the one I'm most excited about. <laughs> and I think it's just because I have never seen that print in real life. Um, but I'm really excited. All right, let's see if I can... When you get something from a different country, like there's so many plastic pieces that they put on everything. All right. Hopefully, I don't stab anything. I always like to lift it up on the sides a little bit um, just to kind of protect whatever's underneath in case they don't put anything to protect it. I'm going to go ahead and rip off this thing here. My slip. <laughs> All right, here we go. Okay. And now I can finish. All right. Alrighty. Okay, so they did put a little bit of um, protection on top here. <laughs> the first thing on top that I can see, uh, Laura's wrapped everything really pretty in tissue paper, pink tissue paper. Let's see here. What is this on top? Important to read this first. Pretty much just letting me know about returns and things like that. Okay, now for the fun part opening everything. Alright, uh, I'll do this first. Ooh, this is really pretty. This is the, uh, the set in Charcoal Roses that I ordered. Oh, I love the print placement because I picked it myself. <laughs> but I really love that. Oh, the back is super pretty. I'm going to open it. Because, like I was showing you guys in that other video, um, they only showed the very front and the very back of the large set piece. Um, so I have no idea what the inside, the other ones look like. <laughs> this one is great for placement. Look at this. So pretty. Even the back's not bad. Um, but the front is gorgeous. I'm really, really excited to see what the small looks like because those are like my favorites. Okay. One side is pretty awesome. I love the white roses. So that is really, really pretty. The back, eh, you know, not that great, but at least one side has it. Now that they don't have the tags on the very front of the small set piece, um, it allows you to have enjoy both sides pretty much. So there's no front, no back. Um, I'm going to claim this as the front. <laughs> and wow, this one is gorgeous. Oh, these are all so pretty. All right. So those are beautiful. I'm going to put them right there. So that was the beast set that I ordered. I get really, really excited about unboxing stuff. It's like, like I said, like Christmas or a birthday or something. The next thing is my Be Neat, which I was the most excited about. This print is way prettier in person than I ever thought it was, um, but I think it's because of the print placement I chose, which of course has Donatella on it. So I'm gonna rip this open. I've been dying to get this so that I could put it on my son so he can eat his, his dinners and things like that. This part is so pretty. With the blue, I wish that they had done more blue stuff on this print because it is so pretty. My magnets are closing on me. I want to fully take it out here. Alright, so like I said in the other video, to me this is the very front, so not this side, which has, in my opinion, not the greatest print placement, but this side has beautiful print placement. So I'm going to flip this. Hmm. There's a little string. There we go. I can trim that later. Um, 
But how perfect is that? Donatella's not even covered up really. Her, her ears and everything are intact. So that is super cute. I cannot wait to put this on him. And I have my elephants and Chow Chow in the middle. <laughs> so that is one of the other things I ordered. I'm in love with this. If they made everything with Donatella on it, like, I would buy that. Like, I don't know if you know what I mean. If they made a print with just Donatella, I'd be all over that. <laughs> okay, the next thing looks like it's the Hobo Bee I ordered. And I've had Iconic in bags before, so um, I've never had it in a Hobo Bee. This is really, really cute. I really wanted something super fun. Like, I have my Queen of the Jungle Hobo Bee already, which is really fun too. Um, but a Tokidoki Hobo Bee is even better. And... I'm going to have to pull it out so you guys can see um, my print placement that I chose on Laura's. Of course, it has Donatella on it and actually has her in uh, quite a few places. For some reason, I really like my strap that it comes with. And I'm not a big Papa Lion person, but he's like big front and center on there and I kind of like it. I'm kind of curious who's on the actual padded part. All this. Okay. Kaiju's on the very top. Um, he's the Godzilla guy, <laughs> kind of dinosaur guy. So this is the front. I have Donatella here, and here, and down here. So to, in my opinion, this is really great print placement, and I really like it. Especially her up here. This is really cute. <laughs> so I'm really excited to get this. Oh, she's even kind of on the pocket back here. They didn't show me those in the pictures, um, so I had no idea. But... Yeah, very, very cute. That'll be really fun to wear. And then this is the thing I'm actually going to have um, my friend Kara mini. Oh, so cute. Okay, that's all that I have. My last thing is the Be Light in Iconic. And in here I just want to show you my print placement. <laughs> like perfect print placement on the back for kaiju too. This is the back. So it has great miniing potential. Super cute. This is the very front. As you can see, I have Donatella here. And I think that's the only place she is. But I'm not a fan of Sandy really. Um, so I think when I get it minied, it'll probably be... no idea but I think it's like I think it's like this much um so that's what it would technically look like when I mini it so that'll be really cute and I'll use this as my purse and I'll put that insio organizer inside it'll be perfect as a purse for me when I'm out and about and I want to have fun with <laughs> some fun toki bag out here where we live um like I went to Claire's and I was getting those Donatella coin purse head thingies and they asked me what it was. They didn't know what Tokidoki was. <laughs> and so nobody out here where I live knows what Tokidoki is. Um, but I do, and I have a lot of fun with it. And people are always looking at my bags and complimenting them. So that's always really fun. So anyways, um, I just wanted to do an unboxing. I know I don't get to do them very often. Um, but but it was really fun. And I really love all my stuff. So this is my, my uh, light that I got in Iconic. And I got the Hobo Bee in Iconic. And then I got my beautiful Bean Neat in Animalini. And then I got this gorgeous Charcoal Roses bee set. And these are the brand new bee sets that they have. So um, you guys can pick out your print placement, like I said in that other video, on Laura's. Um, so you don't have to order blind all the time. Although that is really fun sometimes to see exactly what you get. It's so like pretty much this was almost like ordering blind because I really liked the front and the back of this particular bag, but I didn't know what was inside, and I got surprised, so that was really fun. <laughs> but anyways, I hope this was as fun for you as it was for me. It's like, it's like opening a box for Christmas. <laughs> so anyways, thanks for watching.